Hi everybody, it's Debbie here from Pilates in Bridgewater, that is in fitness. So it's going to be a little bit of a conditioning one just to keep everybody moving, so we're keeping you strong as well. Okay, so keep walking with me, we're starting to warm up, warm up. Okay, just have some fun, who have we got joining us? Okay, glad to have you with me. Just a little bit of um, some gentle toning and some conditioning there. We're going to do some squats, but everything is quite slow and controlled. So we're just walking through the feet first. Who have I got here? Keep going. What a confusing day. Okay, can we pick the knees up a little higher? If you can, pick up those knees. Keep up your abdominals so that you're not putting all your weight down through your legs. We should be keeping some in the core here. So you shouldn't be stamping. You should have nice furry feet. Okay, bring the legs up, get the arms going as well. So we're using this as a warm up just for a couple of minutes. I look after my body and I look after yours in the same way. Okay, hope you're working with me. We'll do this for just for about 30 more seconds. So we should start to be a bit warmer. When we start the moves, we start them off slow so that they're a blueprint for the body. Okay, are we ready? Feet hip this distance, let's squat. Down we go for two, up we go and squeeze at the top. Down we go for two. Don't go too low. When you start off, hi Tina, imagine you're sitting on a um, little, uh, what do you call it, a breakfast bar stool. Don't worry about the music, stay with me. I want you just to do this nice and uh, relaxed, but really kind of some strength through the legs, through the hips. Nice and relaxed through the shoulders, squeeze at the bottom. <coughs> We've got four more. Lovely. Have we got three more? Tina, I hope you're not having a Tina biscuit. I hope you're with me on this one. Two more. And we've got one more. Okay, are we ready? Okay, we're going to go down for two and hold. Down for two. Hold it here. Hold it here. Hold it here. Back up again. Squeeze the top. Down for two. Hold it here, hold it here, abs in. Squeeze at the top again. Down, hold it here. Hold it there, relax the shoulders. Back up again, we've got one more, hold it down, a static squat. Hi Glenis, hope you're joining in. Okay, back up. Let's take it to a march again. So we're setting ourselves up for what we're gonna do with the next movement, so okay. So now I want you to stand on one leg and we're going to take the other leg forward and to the side. Stand up tall, forward to the side. Stand up tall, don't let your body collapse. Stand up tall, don't worry about the music. Keep that leg moving, hold at the top for a second. Hold up at the top, hold at the top, hold at the top. <coughs> hold at the top, Ooh. hold at the top. Hold at the top for a second before you put the foot down. We've got two more. Last one. Okay, marching out again. Well done, lovely. Keep it going. How else have we got here? We've got the same on the other side, standing tall. Leg out to the side. Leg out to the side. Hold it at the top now. Hold it at the top and then hold it at the side. Hold it at the top. Hold it at the side. Hold it at the top. Hold it at the side. Hold it at the top. Hold it at the side. Hold it at the top. Hold it at the side. Well done. I'm glad people are joining in. That makes me feel better. <laughs> well done. The one more I like. <laughs> Okay, march it out. We're gonna start with a little curtsy. So curtsy works your glutes, your bottom muscles, but only if you don't keep turning your body around at the same time. Body, low. So we start off nice and low. Not too low, sorry, start off a little bit higher. Abs in, go a little lower. If you feel comfortable, you can really change this. Take it nice and easy. Take it nice and easy. Keep the hips facing the front though, because we want to get right into the back muscles here. So it's better to do this carefully and slowly and try and do the right thing. Okay, so we're going to keep the chest up. 
So the body is the uh, weight we're working with. We want to push the body away from the floor. We're dropping it down. We're pushing it away from the floor. Breathe in. Now exhale as you put the effort in. Come back down. Put the effort in. And again. One more, please. Okay, march it out. Okay, now we're going to do one where we're going to lift that leg behind us. Are we ready? I'm going to watch out what I've got. Okay, lift the leg behind. Touch the floor if you can. Come back up. Lift the leg in front. Lift the leg behind. Come back down. And up to the top. Woo. And again, keep that leg straight if you can. But bend it if you need to. Woo. If you want to, keep going. All the way down. All the way up. And if you want to, you can sort of use a chair or a puffy. If you're finding it a bit compromised, you can just put the hands down and then come back up again. And do it that way. Let's do four more. Down. Pick the body up. Okay, can we do three more? We're going down. Oh, back up. Okay, we've got two more. Bring the leg forward. Two more. Lift the body up. Okay, have we got one more? One more again. Bring the body up, march it out. So it helps you with the stability of your ankles and your core at the same time. Take the leg out, other side, bring it up. Bring that leg forward. Again, go down. And again, you can go down, put your hands on a puppy or something else. And again, we go down. And lift up. Breathe out as you're pushing away, pulling the body up. Don't push on your fingers. Fingertip, fingernails only, I say. Fingernails only. We've got about six more. Six more. Oh, I can feel this in this buttock. Can you? Five more. Woo! Okay, well done. Glynis, you do this, I hope you are. Three more. And we've got two more. Okay, coming up, one more. Lovely. Okay, marching out. Okay, so we've just got four exercises. We're going to put them all around. Squat down to two, two, up, up. So you should feel a bit looser now. You should feel that you can go a little lower. At the top, I really want you to lengthen and create height through the body. Okay, stay down. Okay, I want you to take a 45 out, come back in, 45 out, come back in, back up, squeeze at the top. Let's go again. Down, 45 on the other side, stay low, 45 this side, bring your body back up, squeeze at the top. Let's go down again, down, out 45, back 45. Out 45, back 45. Bring it up, squeeze at the top again. Okay, we're going out this side. 45, come back in. 45, hope you're doing this, come back in. Can we go a little faster now? One, two, out, in, out, in, two, up, up, squeeze, down, two, out, in, out, in, squeeze at the top, down, out, again, up to the top, one, two, go down, this side, up for two, okay, march it out, do you remember what the second one was, that's right, we're going to lift the leg and the other side, hands out, or slight, it's up to you, lift, 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 slow it down. Hold for a second, hold for a second, hold for a second, hold for a second. We've got four more and three more. Hiya, hiya Sonia, two more. Nice to see you. One more. Okay, march it out. So we've only got four exercises. Just do them at your own pace, just keep yourself moving, it helps your balance. Let's go, front and side. 
front, side. Stay tall through the body. The body wants to slump. Now slow it down. Hold, 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 hold. We've got four more. This is harder than it looks. If you're not feeling challenged, bring your foot up and hold it for that second. Okay, we've got two more. And we've got one more. Okay, march it out. Fantastic, everybody. Okay, what's next? Can you remember it's the curtsies, isn't it? Let's go this side. Step. Don't worry about the music. Just go as low as you can, but keep the body facing the front. So we get that sort of work into the glute at the back. And again, if you can go down so that your knee almost touches the floor, that's great. Keep the shoulders relaxed the whole time. Whole time. Can we now bring the hands up? And we're going to take the hands out as we go down. Hands up. Take it nice and steady. And we come up again. We've got one more. You don't have to go down that low, but we'll just do two more because I Pilates teachers can't count. One more. Okay, okay, march it out. Okay, and if you find problems with your knees, instead of going across, go straight back into a lunge that way. Okay, we're now going to do a little bit of balance work on this leg. Lean forward. If you want to make it a little bit more challenging, you can hold a can of beans in each arm. Bring them up, use your abs. Bring that leg forward. Go down. Lift up. Leg comes forward. How many have we got? That's right, you've only got six more. How's your body feeling? This is deceptively hard, isn't it? Okay. Woo, we've got four more. Lift the stomach up. And we've got three more. Have you got one side that's good and one side that's bad? Woo, I definitely have. Two more. Lifting up. And we've got one more. Okay, lovely. Lovely. Keep marching, keep marching. I just have to move a thing off my screen. Okay, loosen off the legs. So that would have worked for legs here. Okay, we can stand on this side. Take the leg forward. We go down, try and keep that leg as straight as you can. Come back up. Bring it forward again. Go down. And remember, you can put a little... Um, chair or stool here if that's difficult for you to go all the way down you don't have to go all the way down just fingernails and then bring the leg forward so you can do lots of different things you can go down to touch the chair as your leg comes forward again okay can we go down four bring the body up bring that leg forward so you've got that challenge of movement we've got two more Woo. three more sorry Two more, I can't count, I can't remember how many I've done. <laughs> and one more. Okay, march it out. We're on the final round now. We just, I just picked four exercises that try and work around the hips. So if you've got hip issues, this may not be for you. Not every exercise, as my lovely friend Debbie Knight says, is for everybody. <clears throat> Let's just see what you can do. Do a modified version. Here we go, squats, down, Two, five, and in, 45, up for two, up, squeeze, go down. This side, abs in, don't stick your bottom out, up, two, go down again, this way. Hi Jenny, <coughs> up for two, Ooh. back down, one, two, this side. Take it nice and easy, if you've joined halfway through, Please roll, wait to the end and go back to the beginning because you do need to warm your body up. When it's older, and I'm not saying about everybody else, I'm saying about me as well, you need to make sure you get everything right. More important as you get older to get good technique. Come, you can get away with it when you're younger sometimes. May not want to. Okay, one more. Back up, squeeze the bottom. Down we go again, abs in. Okay, squeezing out and march. Loosen off. Okay, so we've got eight. Leg in front to the side, but we're standing on one leg. Here we go. Leg forward. Leg side. Leg forward. 
How can we make this harder? We hold it for a stop here and we stop to the side. Stop here, stop side. Stop here, stop side. If you're not feeling it, bring that leg up a bit more. And stop side. About two more, I reckon. And one more. Lovely. Keep marching. So, <clears throat> how are you feeling today? And a bit of a revelation, isn't it? After the first bit of the lockdown is easing now. People are a bit confused. Here we go this side. But we're going to make our way through it, as we always do. Resilient beings that we are, slow it down. Slow it down. Slow it down. So I'm asking you to control your balance when you're dynamically moving your foot around. This is quite hard, isn't it? But we've got two more of these. I think we probably have. Two more. Ooh. And one more. I've got a bit of a sweat on, don't about you guys. And one more. Okay, keep marching and out. Lovely, we keep going. Now we're going to go back to the curtsies and we're going to start off with two that are low. One, down. Now again, don't rush to keep in time with the music. You want to keep your body forward and get your bottom as far, your leg behind you as you can. Now we're going to take the arm up and out. Shoulders away from the ears, up and out. Stretch up and out. Stretch up and out. I'll say we've got about four more. Well done. Three more. Woo. Two more. And we've got one more. Well done, everybody. Well done. Okay, march it out. We've got the last exercise now. So three rounds of the four. So we're just going to take the leg behind you. If it's making you sore, simply don't do it. Don't participate in this if you've got any concerns about your health and well-being. Speak to me first. My email is debbie at pilatesandbridgewater.co.uk. Okay, lift the leg up. Touch the floor down. Bring that leg forward. How are we doing? Go down. Both hands if you can. Come up. And again. Going down. The body wants you to go fast because it doesn't like this very much because it's having to work quite hard. But you try and stay in control of your tempo. We've got four more of these, just four more. I hope you're doing this with me and not having a cup of tea and a biscuit. <laughs> Three more. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. I'll put the toe down just for a second then. And two more. Oh, muscles are getting tired now, aren't they? Oh, have we got one more? Have we got one more? Okay, bring it up. Okay, march it out. Loosen it off. Okay, we've got the same on the other side. Hi, Annette. Hope you're okay. We'll do some standing work. If you just joined in, make sure you wait and go at the beginning so you get that bit of a warm up that we're going to do. Stand tall, leg forward, leg forward. Can you keep it straight as you go back? And then can you use your abs to bring your body back up again? Can we go down? Inhale here and now exhale as you resist gravity. Inhale as we go down and exhale. Oh, my leg wants to turn out there, that's a bit naughty. Inhale, exhale. Woo, just three more. Down, and back up. Well done, everybody. This is hard going. We've got two more. Lift up. Woo. Last one, last one. Bring it up. Okay, march it down. So you feel the hips there. Just loosen it off. Give me a step touch, please. Step touch. Step touch. Okay, we keep going for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Leg in front now. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, hold it here please. Stay up tall, make sure your hips are level and that one's not come forward. So we anchor this hip down. 
we get the stretch as we push the body backwards. Toe is up, toe is up. Doesn't matter how low you go, keep that toe up. If you feel you can, get your chest a little bit lower. Breathing. Both hands if you can. Lovely. Bring the body up, march it out. Higher. <coughs> We're just going to do the other side. Take those legs out. Sit the bottom back. So that is really your fixed point, and this is your moving point. Sorry, that's your moving point going back. Set it down. Stretch those muscles out. Hello, everybody. Well done for sticking with me. Bring the body up. Okay, so we've got the leg behind us. The leg is behind us. We come up on the toes. We tilt the pelvis and we drop down. Push those pelvises forward, feel that stretch here. So this saves you having to balance on one leg. Keep the head up if you can. Of course, if you want to, you can take the hands up. That's fine, you can take the hands up here if that's you. Okay, and now march it out. Okay, step back for four, four, three, two, one. Stay here, dig the toe into the ground. Come up, tilt the pelvis, abs in, chin up, drop. Okay, arms behind you, open the chest. Okay, relax the arms forward, straight up. I don't do so much stretching forward. And again, behind. Stretch out those muscles. Get those long, straight arms. Take it upwards. Stretch up. Okay, coming up, march it out. So you've just done four exercises, three times through. That's just 12 exercises. So well done, everybody. Give yourself a big round of applause. Rocking on today, have a great day.